What's up, gamers? It's another beautiful Tuesday morning here on the channel. Um, it is episode 38 now of our Mega Build series, and this is the fifth episode of us working on this lumber mill. Now, as you guys can see, I got a lot done on the stream last night. If you guys ever want to catch the in-between episodes, I also work on this stuff on stream. Uh, check the link in the description for the Twitch if you want to get in on that. But uh, yesterday on, the, on the, the end of that episode, we finished this bottom floor. And last night we got started on the top floor. We've got this bottom, this bottom part here to fill in. And the top part will maybe make the, uh, you know, the outside towers a little bit stronger. I still got to fix this little piece in the middle. But uh, make sure you guys hit the like button on this video, man. The likes help so much. And I know so much people love my content and I'm trying real hard to really get out there into the world as far as the content goes. So please hit the like button and uh, subscribe if you're not subscribed and turn them bell notifications on because I'm posting all the time. But we are going to sit here. We are going to try and complete at least this bottom floor here. Um, I did also yesterday get uh, I got some grinders set up in here to grind up some um, grass planks for some fiber because obviously we need tons of fiber for all this crude rope that we're using and now I don't have to sweat trying to figure out how the heck to get it. Now I could put down some spinning wheels and then I'd be able to turn this fiber into um, you know into rope uh, with a one for one ratio rather than a three for one like I do in my inventory but at the same time man like ain't nobody got time for that. Ain't nobody got time for that. Ain't nobody got time for that. <laughs> you already know it man you already know it. You guys are freaking awesome, though. Thank you so much for the support this week. We have achieved, like, over 600 subscribers this week and over 40,000 views on the videos that we posted. So thank you guys so much for the continual support. But I'm out here trying to figure out how I'm going to get my biggest video beat, right? Like, my biggest video right now is a base tour of Rhino's base. It's at 70,000 views. We've had a bunch of videos that are over 10K this week, which is super cool. But I want to know that secret. How do I go from, from growing to exploding? Okay? That's what I want to know, man. You guys want to see it, too. I know you do, dude. Make sure you guys hit that like button, dude. Make sure you hit that like button, man. I'm tired of saying it. No, I'm not really tired of saying it, but I feel like I, sh I, feel like I have to to remind people. Uh, although it is very annoying, and I highly agree that it's annoying. Um, I still have to remind everybody just because sometimes you forget and we're in the growth process right now We're in the we're in the streamline to explosion famous see-through status right now. So we got to get there You know what I'm saying? We got to go We got to go. It's been a good morning so far um, As far as my so far weight loss journey is going um, yesterday I kept track of all my calories and uh, you know like this is the first step for me uh, in order to really realize like what I'm doing wrong and you know adjust but more or less this this week is going to be um I well here's the thing okay I want to lose 120 at least 120 pounds which is, sounds like a lot but since I'm 375 it's not out of the question I just got to put in the work and I'm I'm ready to put in the work man but but I just, you know, I'm counting calories right now, trying to figure out what all I need to adjust. Yesterday, I was at 4,000 roughly calories, and I drank like, I don't know, like six Cokes. And then the coffee and the creamer was like 400 calories. And then I had McDonald's breakfast, dude, and that was what really freaking sent it, sent it sky high. I had some McGriddles. Some things are like 1,400 calories. I was like, oh, my God, I'm never eating McGriddles again. But this is like the part of a, the accountability part, right? Like it's like McGriddles. I just eat them all the time and I had no idea. You know, you just don't know how unhealthy things are until you start crunching the numbers. And now that I'm crunching the numbers, man, it's I'm, I'm getting motivated. You hear me? I'm getting freaking motivated. Like it's, it's about to go down. Like you guys are going to see a whole new see through come a year from now. I'm going to be totally different. Hope, hopefully, hopefully, hopefully. That is if I can find a way to keep up with 365 days a year of grounded videos. <laughs> um, I will be playing. Uh, let me know in the chat if you guys are hyped about some upcoming titles, dude. We've got uh, in the works. We got Small Land in the works. Small Land's going to be an awesome, awesome game. If you haven't heard about it yet, then you must live underneath a rock. But that's fine. I don't judge. You can live under your rock, Patrick. <laughs> you can live under your rock, Patrick, if you want to. Little, 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 little. 
go ahead and do your rock living. <laughs> no judgments here. But small land's gonna be epic. I can't wait. And you better believe that once Sons of the Forest comes out on well, what is it like the 23rd or 24th of this month? Uh, that things are definitely. I'm gonna be definitely trying to pump out some Sons of the Forest. Uh, get a little traction off a new game type of thing. This is like the first time that I feel like I'm smart enough with YouTube uh, to actually take advantage of a new title releasing, although I haven't really did any pre-hype videos, which I should probably do. Um, but yeah, man, I'm just, I'm so freaking stoked about Sons of the Forest. I think it's going to do great things for the channel. I think it's going to be a fun game. And I just can't wait to see it, man. I don't know if, is it coming out on console? I don't know if anybody, I don't know if you guys know. Uh, normally games that are cross-platform are the ones that do the best as far as YouTube goes, because obviously you're re reaching a wider audience. But, uh, you know, if it's not cross-platform, uh, unlucky. You know, a lot, a lot of people get upset that, that games don't come out on Xbox and PC, you know, Master Race and all that good stuff, you know what I'm saying? But, you know, it is what it is at the end of the day. At the end of the day, and then we got Hogwarts Legacy coming out. I probably won't be playing that as I am not really a huge Harry Potter fan. I like Harry Potter, but uh, I believe it actually comes out today for like the pre-order people or something like that, right? So we'll be seeing some gameplay across the interweb for Hogwarts Legacy. But we've got Small Lands, man. We got Sons of the Forest. I'm so freaking excited and hope and hopeful that uh, some of the games I've been following in the development phase are going to be releasing sometime this year i'm just you know i love survival games man i love me some survival games why do i feel like i just did something really weird right there i don't know i feel like i just carried an empty pallet i don't know what i did i don't want to talk about it if i did something weird i guess you could point it out in the chat if you really want to but <laughs> i don't i feel like i did something weird right there something didn't feel right i feel like i carried an empty pallet and an arm full of sticks I don't know, maybe it's still a little too early. Maybe it's still a little too early, but I'm feeling great, man. Today's a good day. Um, I, th I have a base tour with uh, Bunny again, which was one of my first base tours uh, right after this video I'm making right now. Um, I do have a base tour with her this morning, show off her and her husband's world. Pretty stoked about that, uh, seeing you know what they've done. It's been roughly about a month since uh, the last time I've seen what they did. And this will be my first revisit to a world I've already been to. So if you guys have something cool on your world that you want to show off or you want to show off your builds or anything like that, make sure to hit me up in my Discord DMs. That's the best way to do it so that I can keep track of everything so I don't lose, you know, or forget about anybody or anything along those lines. You know what I mean? Do that. And if you join the Discord, heads up. If you join the Discord, I'm warning you. The fishing channel is like a freaking bass fishing tournament right now, man. It is exploding with awesomeness. People are loving the fishing bot uh, that we have in the Discord because you can just type slash fish and it gives you random fish and you sell the fish and you buy a better rod and you catch more fish and you sell those fish and it's just a fun little grindy text game that we've been playing in the Discord. We added it uh, literally uh, two or three days ago now. And I also added in the feature for when people leave so I could tell like who gets upset because they don't know how to mute the dang thing. It's really easy, guys. You just right click on it on the channel and you just mute it. You can right click on the category and just mute it too. So, I mean, if, you know, it's put there so people can enjoy the Discord a little bit more than they already did. But at the same time, I can't mute channels for everybody, sadly. I wish I could, man. I wish I could just mute it for everybody so I didn't have to worry about it. But, yeah, I don't know, but I'm so excited for I'm hoping we get a release date soon for small lands with the uh, following up sons of the forest coming out this month I'm glad that we actually get a solid release day for sons of the forest There's gonna be all kinds of cool cool stuff that that game can do the building Oh my god guys, you know, we're gonna go absolutely ham in the building on that game uh, They've they've I'm stuck. What the heck that was weird. I, I got stuck inside of the pallet somehow <coughs> Yeah, that game's building is crazy, man. They've they really stepped up their game. I forgot a pallet. They really stepped up their game as far as the like like almost like the realism of 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 building. 
like you split logs in half and then you you know you to make the floors and then you like carve out the spikes on the top of the logs oh my god man it's gonna be it's gonna be wicked it's gonna be wicked hopefully people enjoy the let's plays that i'm gonna do because i'm most definitely gonna do some let's plays of the forest i'm not gonna ever quit doing grounded content grounded's gonna always be happening but i gotta throw i gotta throw some of that other stuff in there too you know to make make sure my sanity doesn't decrease at all because uh you know if you play the same game for too long no matter how successful you are there is a pretty good chance that you're either gonna fall off the deep end or uh just get so bored that you can't you can't handle it anymore do -do 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 -do. i am like the stick collecting master except for i'm out again i'm all out again it's all right we're gonna try we're gonna lay it all down and uh you know hopefully we'll see if we can make it through this through this floor in this episode without making another 45 minute one like yesterday that was a long one man holy crap by the way if you're still watching and you haven't subscribed yet man only only 14 percent. we went from two percent the other day which was absolutely insane that's a huge jump dude we got 600 some followers this week or subscribers this week um we went from two percent to now 14 percent. but still you know However many that is, 78% uh, of people are still watching my videos and are not subscribed, man. You guys could really change my life by just hitting that sub button. You could really do it. It's a big thing, man. Hit it. Hit it. Hit it. Are you tired of me saying it yet? I'm tired of saying it. So why don't you just hit it already? What are you waiting for? What are you waiting for? Are we 10 minutes in yet? We are 11 minutes in. Here comes the first word, okay? The first word of the day is going to be coil. Coil. Take that word coil, hide it in the comments, type me up a story with the word coil, but just wait because there is going to be another word come about the 20 minute mark ish. So make sure you uh, hang around for that one. And then there might be an additional bonus word at the very end. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, I've been having a lot of people actually participate in this uh, whole uh, drop a comment with the random word thing. It's, it's pretty fun, man. I'm glad people I'm glad people enjoy our little silly shenanigans during these videos. I'm really feeling great today, man. I'm telling you guys. I, I don't know if you can tell. I could assume you could tell because some days I'm kind of on the low end of, of hypeness, but today is one of the high end of hypeness days. I hope my son can actually make it through a whole day of school today without freaking losing his lunch again. I don't know what's up with that, man. It's just crazy. But the, even the nurse, like when I went to pick him up, yesterday at noon or whatever because he, he goes to school till two normally but uh picked him up at noon and the nurse was telling me that almost everybody in the school has that oh my god dude what a virus to have almost everybody in the school having it right now but apparently they've only been at about 50 percent attendance throughout the whole school which is crazy that's absolutely nuts absolutely nuts man Oh, yeah, we're totally going to get this done in this episode, bro. At least this floor and maybe even the walls, if I'm lucky. Maybe even the walls. These dang bees, dude. One of these times, they're going to walk past me and just take me out. I forget that I have to eat in this game occasionally. Like, while I'm building like this, I always forget that I, I have a tummy. I have a tummy that I must keep full. All right. Looks like we're going to be able to at least complete this row as well, which is good news. I didn't think I'd have enough to, to do this whole thing. This is how I prefer doing these lines, man. One pass and then come back through and full complete them. I'm not a big fan of holding down the button. You guys know this. It's very weird. I don't, I don't really like it too much. Um, here we go. So there. All right. Cool. And it looks like our checkerboard pattern is holding true. Um, here we go. Like that. Dude, this is awesome. We're almost done with this third floor here, which is actually amazing. My sticks are out of reach of those last couple pieces there, but I think I'm actually running out anyway. Oh, we got still got a couple coming into coming into focus here. All right, I think we're totally out now. Can complete some of these. All right, cool. All right, let's get some more sticks. We don't have a whole lot more that we need. Um, I do still need and want to clear out all this grass over here, but I think I'm going to do that on my own time. 
Um, let's see if we've got any more. Oh, yeah, we got the whole forest over here done respawned. Let's freaking go, dude. Look how fast it... That's so crazy. It respawns so quick. So quick. All right, let's get a sip real fast before I continue. And, uh... At least it's clean. I'll get this sip, and then I'll see if I can't grab another one over here real fast. Uh, with the lack of water and everything else over here, I might need to, uh... Might need to make one of my water towers over here. And then maybe I can grab a weevil or something over here by the mushrooms. They tend to hang out. There we go. We get the aphid. And we're good for another day here. Pretty good. We're good for another day. Let's do some more chopping. Let's do some more chopping. All right, cool. Yeah, this will be. This ought to be enough to uh, help us finish that last floor. Cool, cool, cool. But small lands, dude. Oh my god. I don't think small lands is gonna be crossplay either, which really sucks. I don't know if it will be or not. Actually, I really don't know. I really don't know. They haven't told us much about it. But you know, most games these days are gonna be a whole lot better off if they go crossplay. Apparently, it's a big uh, developmental like loophole or thing they have to jump through to actually get get games into crossplay. I know I was speaking to the Aloft devs on their live stream the other day about making a loft crossplay and they seem like it was kind of a pain in the butt to do. Um, I have like a whole new respect for developers the past couple weeks, like dealing and talking with game developers and stuff, which is super cool, by the way. I didn't think I would ever in my life ever have a chance to talk with some of these companies, but so freaking cool, man. Um, the 22nd is going to be our co-stream with Obsidian um as long as xbox live holds up again this time uh they'll actually get to come onto my world and check it out so that's, i'm trying to 100 percent make sure i get this done by the 22nd which i don't think will be a problem hell i think we might even be able to start another another build and finish it by then the ship maybe i don't know i don't know we'll see i still got some stuff to do around town as well uh some cleaning up tidying up to do but uh, I'm just waiting to get re-inspired for the town right now. So I spent a lot of time on it this uh, past week trying to get ready for our Obsidian stream that got messed up by Xbox Live being all screwy. But hey, you know, everything happens for a reason, by God. I'm a firm believer in that. I'm a firm believer in everything happens for a reason. It's very unfortunate that it happens, but, you know, it does happen. It does happen for a reason. Dun, 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 dun. Let me grab this elusive stick over here because it seems to be wanting to be on its own program. I don't even know how it got up there. If we got any uh, former veterans in the chat, man, drop a link, drop a comment down below, man. Let me know like where you served and what time what time you did and all that good stuff. Uh, for those of you that don't know, I am a veteran of the Marine Corps. I was in from 2007 to 2011 and I was what they call food service. I was the guy that cooked all the food for all the Marines and and Navy because they were on the base as well. At least the one I was stationed in. I was stationed in Okinawa, Japan. I never went to Afghanistan or Iraq or anything. I had a lot of friends that did. I had friends that went and came and never came back. Um, I had friends that went and came back. But I never got a chance to go because my knees were so screwed up. So, you know, I had a bunch of surgeries and stuff when I was in and pretty much just injuries from boot camp and things of that nat nature. And uh, they just never healed properly. And more or less, I pretty much ended up doing my entire four years as the disabled cook guy that everybody knew. <laughs> But, uh, you know, there's 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 some people that you want to keep real close when you're in the military. And if you can make a friend with a guy that works in the mess hall, that's the best friend to have, man, because you get free chow, baby. I had all kinds of friends like that. They'd hook me up with different stuff, and I'd hook them up with some food. Although, although the chow hall was free food for military people, obviously, um, you know. You could only get so much. So if you wanted the plug, I was the plug for the food, man. I was the food plug. <laughs> I know I got a couple of my veteran buddies that uh, or that I was actually in the core with that watch that watch some of these videos too. It's hard to believe. Like that's one of the big driving forces behind my uh, behind me losing weight is you know these knee problems have really put me in just kind of a lazy state of mind and 
you know, at the end of the day, my core values are mind over matter. You know what I mean? So I just got to get, if I can lose some weight, my needs are not going to hurt so bad. So, you know, I got to, got to get that done. But my biggest goal, the thing that drives me the most and pushes me the most to do this is I want to fit in my dress blues. I still have my dress blue outfit. I still have my dress blue uniform. I guess it's not an outfit, duh. but uh, yeah, I still have my dress blues and I want to be able to fit in them again someday. That is the biggest dream that I've got. That's the biggest dream that I got. Matter of fact, that's going to be our second word because we are 20 minutes in just now. The second word is going to be blues. There's about 20 different meanings to the word blues, so you should be able to figure it out. You should be able to figure it out. I'm excited to see what they got, uh, what they've done with their base. Hopefully, it's a lot. That would suck if they brought me in there and all of a sudden, you know, they just did a little tiny, tiny thing. I guess that's the, but that's the, that's the thing you run into when you do like a retour. A retour. Do 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 do. I don't know. This is my first time I'm doing this, so hopefully it's a, hopefully it's a banger. I know they were working like on a hotel in the Mosquito Pond. Uh, not the Mosquito Pond, but like the Aphid Island Pond. I know they were like talking about working on a hotel or something over there, so maybe they got that done. Maybe, maybe, maybe. We'll see. We'll see. I'll upload this one first, and then I'll upload that one after, probably an hour after this one. So keep a lookout for both of them. Both of them. Uh-oh. Oh, it's just freaking spam. I thought that was the school calling me. I was like, oh, man, I'm not done with my video yet. Just spam. Freaking spam calls, man. Happens all the time. All right, let's go ahead and I'm going to drag some of these over here because I know I've got some, some stick spots that are out of reach. And let's get up there and see if we got enough to finish off what we've got to finish off here. Um, next floor. There we go. There we go. Okay. Okay. All right. Yep. 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 I can reach pretty much all of them from here. Nice. I might have to go back down there to get some more to complete this last row. Is this the last row? This is the last row. Oh no, don't do that. Don't mess up the pattern now, man. It's going to be a big pain in the butt. All right, I think we're go I think we're golden here. Oh, I need to grab some more crude rope for sure. Let me at least pile through these stems and see if I need to grab some more or move some pallets around. We're getting low. It's getting low. Come on. We got this. Hey, okay, let me do the rest of the stems. All right, so let's go down here and grab some more rope. I don't believe I have any more in my backpack. Nope, I sure don't. I do have two fluffy dandelion tufts now from chopping all these uh, weed stems and sticks and everything. Okay, gimme, 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 gimme. 75, 100. Perfect, dude. Perfect. And I'm and I'm actually utilizing all this grass that I have now, which is great. Which means I can fill it up with more. It's just like a it's just like a crude rope factory down here, dude. Eventually I'll get maybe spinning wheels over here like after after the fact and just uh start going ham with with uh, making crude rope, I guess. That is if I have any more plans for you know, this. Come on. Make them all. Make them all. Make them all. Make them all. Better, 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 better. Thank God they have a craft mini times five. I, I really wish there was just a craft all. Like we got a craft, a craft times five, and then I wish we just had a, a craft all button. Just give me a craft all button, man. There's still a couple quality of life things I would like to see change, but you know, at the end of the day, this game's so freaking good that you just can't complain right you just can't complain it's just so good um all right cool so now we should be able to uh set these walls there we go we can lift this up to here 
start getting our walls all the way around. Get this part done, at least for the thumbnail screenshot. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. All right, cool. Perfect. Oh, yeah, dude. It's coming along. It's coming along so nicely. All right, I need to put a floor in this one, I think. Um, let's see here. So I guess I could drop down and maybe just go floor here and then like this. And then we can get this guy and oops, that one's too high. And this guy here. All right, let's go back up there. See if I can't complete that floor. I don't know how many sticks I got left, but we'll see. Cause I would like to complete one more wall around this thing too, to really get it looking nice. It looks like we're going to be okay, dude. It looks like we're going to have enough to do it. I say that, but then I think my sticks are out of reach, dude. I think my sticks are out of reach. Oh, they are just barely, dude. I'm not going to be able to, uh, 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 uh. come on. Ah, oh, dude, I can't reach them. Sad face. One more piece left on friggin lucky, dude. Oh, almost fell off. Unlucky. All right, I'm going to grab this whole pallet here. Take this one with me back up to the tippy top. I'm going to eventually invent a better way to get up to the different floors in here. I don't know exactly how I want to do it just yet, but uh, that's the plan at least. So, all right, let's raise this up here for the sake of the thumbnail. Yeah. For the sake of the thumbnail and we do this crossover piece here and here and here and there like that all right cool perfect perfect and then i got a few more pieces left over go ahead and get started on this wall section um we'll be able to do that many all right cool dude we're almost to the point where we get to start working on the crane man this has been a hellacious work in progress holy crap this is so much there's so much stuff. Oh my God. And I've went through these pallets of sticks. I can't even tell you like 9 million times it feels like, but, uh, it's looking great, dude. It's looking absolutely great. Now it looks super good. Oh yeah. This is, this is cool, man. We're getting there chat. We're getting there. We're getting there. Well, thank you guys for watching this video, man. I got to get prepared for my base tour video, but make sure you guys like, if you haven't yet comment down below with uh what was our words i already forgot again i always forget because they're just kind of like right off the tip of my tongue blue was one of them i remember blues blue something like that and then uh yeah i don't know dude i'm always picking up sprigs i got so many sprigs holy hot deposit all that jazz what i got in here anything nothing really all right y'all have a good day and we'll see y'all in the next one bye see ya